Hi, my name's Steve Colpus and I'm one of the coaches at Front Range Volleyball Club. And uh, today we're going to be working with uh, our 13 Scarlet team, uh, just doing a little bit of work that we've been doing on serving. And hopefully this will give you a few ideas that uh, may or may not help you to teach serving to younger, younger age groups. So hopefully you'll enjoy this. Okay, so the first question I've got for you. What's the most important part of the serve? The toss. So all your coaches in the past have told you correctly. The most important part is the toss. So what do we need to try and do when we toss the ball? As high as you can reach, very good. What else? In front of you, good. Excellent. So we want to make sure that when we toss the ball, it goes straight up and down. It doesn't come back over our head or go out too far. So we're going to do a little practice here that uh, will help you to make sure that every time you toss the ball, it's going to go straight up and down. Okay? So, in order to help us toss the ball straight up and down, we're going to use our friend here, the wall. Okay? You just hand me the wall. Just stand there for a second. So, I'm right-handed, so I want to hold the ball across my body so it's in front of my hitting shoulder. Opposite foot forwards, ball nice and close to the wall. And what I'm going to do is toss the ball so it goes straight up and down the wall. If I toss it forwards, it'll rebound off. If I toss it back, it'll come off the wall. So I'm trying to get it so that it goes straight up and down the wall because then what I'm going to try and do I'm going to put my hand on the top of the ball as I toss pull my arm back and I'm going to trap the ball on the wall with my hand and I want my hand to be like a paddle really flat really hard everyone put their hand up fingers fingers close together it could be like Spock at uh, Star Trek. Okay, fingers close together. So you should almost see, I can see it happening over there. Blood draining out of her hands there as she's so hard. We want to make this hard so when we hit the ball, we're hitting it with a hard, flat surface. You got it? So it looks like this. My hand's on the top of the ball. Pull my arm back. Toss up the wall. Whoa! What happened? Wasn't a good toss. When I put my hand on the ball, didn't hit the middle of the ball, it slides off. Here we go again. Hand on the ball, back, good toss. What happened that time? Too high, ball dropped down. So when I get it right, here, toss, I should get that. And my hand is in the middle of the ball, on the equator, and I'm leaning on the wall with my hand here. Fingers pointing straight up. Have a go. Yes, now. So, hand on the ball, right, uh, opposite foot forwards. Knees bent a little. Okay, good. Toss. Ah. So she couldn't trap it because her toss came off the wall. So try this time, straight up and down the wall. A little bit better. Bring that elbow back. Elbow back. Elbow back. In front, you're hitting shoulder. Whoa! Not too many traps going here. We're not trapping the ball too often. That's it. Take care of your toss. Some of you aren't tossing. Hold up. Stop. So we don't want to be shot putting. I don't want to. I don't want to see this. We're not shot putting. It's here. Elbow back, toss, arm comes through, elbow forwards, and bang. Above and in front, my hitting shoulder. Better. Trap that ball with that paddle you just made. Ha hard is ha Ugh, hand, hand is hard. That's it. Ah, still a lot of tosses coming off the wall. That was a good toss. 
Yes, good. Bring your elbow back. That's it. Now ready? Toss. A little bit better. Yeah. Okay, stop. You're going to move about five or six feet off the net. Off the wall, sorry. Do exactly the same thing you've just been doing at the wall. Only now, as you serve the ball, it's going to hit the wall, rebound straight back over your head for your partner to catch. Now, if you don't hit the ball in the middle, it's going to go off to the side and she won't be able to catch it. So this is going to help you to serve the ball in a straight line. Okay? So I'm here. I do everything I've just done. Hand on the top of the ball. Hand is hard. Draw my elbow back. Toss. Was that successful? That's good. Now, the other thing that's going to be important here, I want you to keep your hand high until the ball is gone. I don't want you serving the ball and then bringing your arm down. Why do you think that is? Because the ball will float if I keep my hand high. Yes, it will. Why else don't I want to bring my hand down? Too soon. Because you want to see if it was straight, if it didn't go to your partner. You want to see Partly. What else might happen? So the ball doesn't have top spin in, so it won't drop. It might put top spin on the ball, which will make it drop and go into the net. So this time my partner is going to shout down after they've caught the ball. And that's my signal to move my hand down. Okay? So it looks like this. Here I am again. Ready. Now I can bring it back. She gives me the ball again. We go again. Ready. Got it? Oh, that's a problem. So it should, it should stay in a straight line. Your partner should be able to catch it without the ball bouncing. So hit it hard. Hit it hard. There's a good one. Good girl. Straight line. If it goes off to the side, you're not hitting the middle of the ball. Or your toss is off. So I really like this because it does force the, force the servers to actually serve the ball in the direction they want it to go. And if they don't hit the middle of the ball or if they toss the ball across their body, then as you can see from some of the uh, attempts here, the serve is not going to go where they're expecting it to go. Um, so I really like this. And I like the idea of making them call down. You'll see some of them have forgotten already. Um, so we want to make them keep that hand high until the serve is gone. And now they're starting to do it a lot better. I can see that already. Keep your hand high. Keep your hand high. Don't finish it. Make sure your partner says down. If your partner's saying down and your arm's already down, you've not done it right. You can hold. So you can see we've uh, put an elastic between the two antenna. What we're going to try and do is, as we're serving the ball, we want to serve that ball so it goes flat, over the net, nice and hard, under the elastic. Okay, that's our goal. So that elastic and the top of the net have made like a window that we're going to try and serve through. We're going to start off partner to partner, 10 foot line to 10 foot line and you're going to go through it in exactly the same way you've just been doing. Here, pull back, toss, through the window, you catch it, serve it back. Woo, stop. Do the routine, do the routine. Put your hand on the top of the ball. Oh, she's gone. Don't worry about it. Okay, hand on the top of the ball, pull your arm back. And the other thing I want us to do is I want you to still be saying down. What we're trying to do is, hopefully I get this right, I'm here, I'm trying to push it flat through. Down, thank you. Through the window. Through the window. Good. 
Don't forget, keep your hand high. That's very good, Alton. Very good. That's the idea. Good. You can see as we're doing this, you're starting to toss the ball behind your head. So you're actually hitting the ball here. You want to be hitting the ball out here. So all your weight is on your front foot. Keep going. That's better. Front foot. Ah. So it, when you toss that, it went way back here. Straight up and down. Straight up and down. So okay. now, every time you successfully put the ball through the window, you could take a big step back. Not your partner, you've got to do it as well. Once you succeed, you can take a big step back till you eventually get back to the serving line. But you can only do it if you go through the window. Okay? As you get further back, then we can allow the ball to bounce before you catch it. But here, close up, we need to catch it without it bouncing. Okay? So you can get back to the serving line first. Didn't go straight to your partner. You can't take a big step. Only gets a big step if it goes straight to your partner. Still keep your hand high. You're still shouting down. Keep your hand high. That's good also. I like that serve. Good. Hit the ball harder now, you guys. Still through the window. Still keep your hand high. That's very good. Very good. Good. Make sure you watch the ball so you hit the middle of the ball. Good serve. Good serve. The one last... Um, Probably one of my most, uh, my best secrets on serving is the moment that you strike the ball, I want you to make a noise. Why do you think I want you to make a noise? Excellent. Tightens your core, and when we tighten our core, the ball's going to go faster and harder. Some of you are going to be embarrassed about making a noise. Don't be. You won't be, I know. Yeah. So, you see tennis players do it all the time. Every shot they make, you hear them make a noise. And it's just to make their core tight and strong so that their shot is harder. So this is the same for volleyball. So even if you're a little bit embarrassed about going... Ah! If you're embarrassed about that, then the very least you must do is, when you toss that ball and you make a contact, you're gonna go, Hoop! almost like you're about to throw up. Got it? So for the last couple of minutes, these last serves, let me hear you uh, make a noise. Listening. Yes, I like it. That was a good hook, that was a good noise. Didn't hear much over here. Come on, if I go near, everybody's going to hear your noise. Oh, there's a good noise over there. All right, let's see how loud you can be. Take your time. Okay, yeah. Okay, so we're going to finish. We'll finish up with. What things, what things are you going to think about now when you're serving in future? Tell me. Yes? Tossing the ball straight up in front of you. Tossing the ball straight up and down in front instead of behind us or too far in front. Good. Maybe like tightening my core when I serve. Maybe if I don't make a noise. Even if you don't make a noise, you are going to make a noise. You are going to make a noise. Okay. What else? 
What else? Strong hand, make it nice and hard like a flat paddle, yes? Say that again. Yeah, trying to keep my hand up and not letting it go down till the ball's left my hand. Not going straight down as I hit the ball. Serve through the window. Yeah, big one. Try and serve through the window. One of the reasons we can do that is because of the height of the women's net. If we serve the ball really hard and we get it through the window, it's kind of almost, you, can, you can't serve it too hard. It'll still go in. But if you go over the top of the window, serving hard is going to go out of bounds. So that's why that window is so important. Okay, anything else? Good, so you're all going to serve real well in uh, Northern Lights. I'll be looking at your stats. Good job, girls.